welcome back to the studio. So I am going to be doing a few craft items on my channel uh, over the next few weeks. I know usually I'm doing painting and I'm doing some jewelry, but I'm getting ready for my daughter to get married. So I'm forced to do some crafts that I have not normally done um, in general in my art studio. So we're going to do them together and hopefully you'll learn some real fun things that you can do to pretty up your home or get ready for a party. All right, so continuing on with some of the wedding decorations that we're doing. Under the bride and groom's plate, we're going to have two chargers. Her wedding ring is actually um, a, a uh, rose gold, so I'm going to use a rose gold paint to go over top of the chargers. I'm going to sponge it on and cover these completely. I'm going to use a stencil letters and when they're done being painted I'm going to do the sponge paint completely dry then use a sharpie to outline the words mister on one and on the other we'll do missus Then I'll just fill that in with some black enamel paint and then I'm going to show you the end product so this video is not too long. And I'll be back with you as soon as I'm done sponge painting. Again, rose gold, outlining in black Sharpie, and then filling in with black enamel paint. Be right back. Alright, so I finished with the rose gold on top of this. So in contrast, this is the original color. This is the rose gold. It is really difficult, I know, to see the differences on the camera sometime. All right, so next I'm going to take some folk art metallic champagne, and I'm going to make little pearls all around the outside edge of this. I did try gold. It didn't give me enough of a contrast between the rose gold and this. So let's, um, let's use our folk art pearl. Now I'm going to put a tiny bit in the lid, just a tiny bit. Don't need much for this. Maybe one drop. Now this is, a t is not in any way watered down, so it's the original paint. So I'm just going to take the opposite end of an old paintbrush and I'm going to begin my dots. Just replenishing as I go along. That's beautiful. That's And here is the finished plate that says Mr. And it has nice pearl kind of sheen to it. And then we'll do the same thing with the charger that says Mrs. And, and I've also finished the Mrs. charger. So... Now we have chargers for both Mr. and Mrs. underneath of their plates at the wedding reception. So thank you for watching.